of society, you're obligated to cheat. That's what the wealthy do. Stop thinking that they work so hard to obtain their wealth because if they work that hard, then why would they need slaves? Their wealth was inherited or was stolen, then passed down from parent to child, parent to child, parent to child. Ask the natives. All this land is worth a lot of green, and this is why when slavery ended, black folks never received 40 acres of mule and $100. But instead, we live like roaches in these black ghettos of America. And if you notice, it's using their highway or highway overpass. It's called social engineering. But we're simply enjoying the fruit of a social illusion. This is why black folks come outside on fleek with expensive sneakers on their feet, but the hood looks like it's going through a great depression. And I bet you're going to say it's black folks' fault, but nobody ever looks like this. When we came here, we were like strangers in a strange land. Then we were set free with no home, no land, no food, no clothes, no friends. Jim Crow segregated. Prosperous black towns burnt to the ground. And now the criminal element is set. And every rhyme that a rapper kick correlate, how you gonna commit some kind of felony? In my neighborhood, they got corner stores in the middle of the block. Remember me? I'm telling you that black people in America are plant minorities. It's done through a system of proper planning, planned parenthood, and birth control. In fact, the whole point of taking the census was to monitor black people <clears throat> and make sure our population never got past 12% again. Why you think you get smothered by immigrants? They come to America to receive unearned benefits and they get classified as white. So Asians fight for Asian rights. Hispanics fight for Hispanic rights. Black people, we still fighting for civil rights. We fight for everybody to get their foot in the door. But once they get their foot in the door, they turn around and tell you, sorry, but I don't speak English. <laughs>